A viewer asked me how to put a hole, a square hole, through a, a cone. Uh, so I found a couple of ways to do this. Uh, so here we go. I'm going to make a new design and we're going to make a cone pay for pull select like the top face here now we can cornify it we can drag drag it that way or that way, up or down, we'll do a cone like that. We can in fact make it into a point if we want to pull and pull that. Whee. Okay. Now to put a put a square hole in here. Now there are two ways. Well there's several ways, but if you want the cone if you if you want the hole parallel with the or at right angles to the slope here, simply go to the select tool, select the slope, then K key, press the K key to get a sketch plane. Now if you rotate it a bit you see that the sketch plane is orientated on the face. So press the V key to square it up. Then we can select the rectangle. Uh, I'm going to put one down the middle. So, I'll, uh, okay, we'll make it a square. Right. Now, P for pull. If we rotate it, we see that it's running parallel to the surface. Now, with the pull tool activated, select it, and then select cut. So we're going to cut through, square it around a bit so we can drag it, and then just drag it. And we've got a, a, a square cut through at that angle. But if we want to cut it uh, parallel to the base here, what we'll need to do is again select select the base, press the K key to get a sketch plane. Now down here, this little arrow pointing up, select that and we're going to turn this sketch plane through 90 degrees. Oh, I've got it 90. Perfect. Then just drag it off. V. Uh, I think we're going to run into this hole, but it just shows the principle. So now again, another rectangle somewhere about here. P for pull. Select on negative and we've got it running through parallel to the base. So that's how to put a square hole in a cone. Hope you might find that useful and interesting. Bye. Well, hello. Um, I've got. I feel I've got to make make a statement here because I've suddenly become aware that uh, I, I have not been getting any comments on my videos for a while. Uh, this is uh, puzzling me. So I did some research and found out that there might be a couple of reasons why this is happening. Apparently it may be because YouTube 
have made changes to the way notifications are, are sent to creators. So I've had a look at my settings and a few other things on my channel and I've made a few changes which may have affected uh, the notifications coming through. So if you're wondering why I haven't been replying to your queries and suggestions etc this is probably what caused it. So hopefully these changes in my settings uh, will you know correct the fault and fix it. So fingers crossed that this has fixed the problem and hopefully I'll start getting uh, your comments coming through onto my email account. So stand by and I'll let you know if, uh, if this uh, fix works. Anyway, keep watching, please subscribe, thank you, bye.